Hey y'all, let's see what we got. Leo and Libra. Y'all could have the same shits going on, similar stories, you're dealing with each other, or the things are in your chart. Uh, it's up to you to figure out how it does or doesn't resonate. Alright y'all, you can flip flop the things. Anywho, let's go ahead and have a look, see what's going on for Leo and Libra. Motives, questioning the things. Why are people the way that they are? Healing, vitality, it sounds like somebody's vital signs as well. Deception. Uh, there's something about a group of people or some so some women over here. It seems to be uh, there's some, something in the air with the women today uh, or recently, I guess. All right. Taylor of Ages. Why them? I don't know. Why, 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 what? Mind your own business. In order to attain the impossible, one must attempt the absurd. Uh, I guess that's why. All right, Leo and Libra. Let's go ahead and have a look, see with some tarot. What's going on here? What is this? Um, ooh, the star. Why? Because someone's a star, I guess. Uh, so the things that seem impossible, I don't understand how they happen. How did we get here? Lots of lesson learning, karma as well. Six of Cups for some past stuff, like uh, the Hermit has done a lot of introspection, thinking, healing, becoming a healer, born to be a healer, definitely having had to death be left out in the past year to have a death to be alone here, to die alone in order to be reborn to a pentacles, not belonging someplace and being like ostracized here, three of pentacles, that's the five of pentacles and the three of swords. Uh, the inability to work with people has been like to somebody's benefit, the Empress, three of swords, uh, transmuting pain and sorrow, ten of cups into joy and happiness, nine of cups, wish fulfillment. Uh, I want to say, like, you know, we, we all say, like, we want to grow up being such and such. And, you know, we make these plans 20 years ago. And now here we are 20 years later. We never would have made the same plan. So I guess, you know, hindsight, perspective. There is something great here. And somebody knows that, like, the great things come at some sort of loss. I do feel like someone's jealous of someone's gifts here. And this is, like, uh, three of wands. Five of Cups and the Devil. I fucking knew it. I said jealous. And then there it is. And then in this one, it's a woman, y'all. So, somebody like, uh, definitely not a sword. They stress about this shit all the time. Somebody's having dreams about some woman. About being separated from someone over here. In the future, somebody uh, wants to address the... The past regrets and stuff, but uh, this obsession is just right smack in the way of being able to send a message. Somebody's like, I can't even use the swords, get the message out because uh, somebody is like afraid of their own shadow. They're afraid of you. You're afraid of them. Ace of Wands, afraid of what the other people will see and think and say. It's like, who cares? Who cares? What is this? The King of Cups. The Queen of Cups and the Three of Cups. Somebody does definitely wants to reconcile here. Just like by, bygones be by, bygones. Like, can we both like lay it all out on the table? Let's be mature. Let's let's hatch this out. Let's heal it, Empress. Um. So somebody definitely wants to come clean. There's been all this deception here, and look at I just split the deck to this here, and there's like. A lack, somebody is having a hard time with the strength, like, just get on with it. It's like if I tell people and everyone's going to know that I was like lying, some shit like that. If I don't believe you, always be specific when you lie. Red flags. Where else you got? I told you so. Return to sender. <sighs> So I don't know, when people tell you who they are, you should believe them, is what I feel like, you know what I mean? So people have said, you know, like, or shown themselves, uh, the red flags, people don't believe it, or it's like, you know, mm, trust your gut, your inspirational quote has inspired me to unfriend you, treat people the way that you want to be treated. Somebody has uh, gone above and beyond 
to persecute somebody. And now it's like being in that position and like being like, like the knees are knocking so scared. Happiness is not something ready made. It comes from your own actions. Don't make yourself easy for everyone. I don't know. I also feel like sticks and stones may break my bones, but names will never hurt me. You know, like, what are you going to, what is all that anyways? Like, I, I don't, I don't really care. Maybe that's half the problem why people can't go make up and stuff. Cause it's like, they never really cared in the first place. They were unbothered. When I let go of who I am, I become of who I might be. And I, it's not that. It's a, it's a progression. It's a growth. It's maturity. It's, uh, okay. Anywho, the world. It's closing cycles and using boundaries too. Like, boundary, you're not allowed to treat me like that. I'm not going to stick around for that shit. Societal upheaval. Oh, there's a mess everywhere, y'all. Just saying. One disaster after another disaster. I do feel like this is a very scary energy. Somebody has a lot, it's a lot of afraid stuff over here. I also feel like this is kind of the part of the I told you so. What's this right here? Exposed criminality. Like, so and so is going to get, you know, all these things are going to happen. Somebody has like made predictions. Thank you very much. And the things are coming true. And the people are like, I cannot even believe what I'm seeing right now. Like, you know. Uh, let's just take the kids out of school. Let's go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and know you're crazy. We're not going to do that. But the world is, you know, it's going bananas. And it's like, no, you're going bananas. But then fast forward, you know, 15 years later, and it's like, oh, my God. I think I was the bananas one. We should have taken the kids out of school and all that shit, memorabilia. So somebody's going right down the lane of fucking, you know, yesterday's past, being haunted by some un, un, unfinished business here. There's also a lot of ghosts and ESP. What did I say? With the people fucking saying the things that are going to happen. All right. Now the things are happening. And you can't help but unsee them. Somebody is a medium. They, they're fucking, they get told stuff all the time out here. A prophecy. Thank you very much. That's what it says right there about the end of times, about cataclysms, about dire predictions, about the doomsday, about police shit, corruption, and undercover. I don't fucking know about all sorts of stuff. Anywho. Oh, somebody knows things. And somebody's like, that's really scary. And I don't I don't want to hear that. I don't want to make fun of the people here. And it's like, well, I'm telling you, there's going to be like chaos. I don't know why nobody's listening to me. Now that the chaos is here, it's like... Um, all somebody can think of is like wanting to run far away from hearing that stuff 15, 20 years ago. Now realizing that they should have been paying attention. You should have, we should have been paying attention the whole time. I also feel like, you know, sell your soul. Like there's a, there's a lot of mixed, uh, things out here. The occult. Somebody could be afraid of it. They could have been told that it's like, you know, evil, this, that, and the other thing. And, or, you know, I don't know. You know, people tell me, you know, like, uh, it's evil. It's blah, blah, blah. I don't really care. Uh, God didn't start me and I don't care. So fucking Jesus. I also believe that, you know, the Egyptian things and the gods and the things were real then. The stories have morphed over and over and over again to be able to explain a larger thing to us. All right. So I don't, I don't know why... Thousands of years ago, we're only, we only got one man that walks on water. Get the fuck out of here. We're all God's children. Why do you only make the first one special? Uh-uh. Mm-mm-mm. And we're already all here. Already. So I just can't with the whole thing. And I'm not... I don't have any proof or anything. And we're all aliens, too. All of us. We're all, like, mixed breed, fucking all that shit. So get over it. All right, this is terrorist attack. Hmm. Mm-mm. Poverty. Something to do with the big cities and the skyscrapers and shits like that. Uh, crowds, big business. I mean, all, there's a lot of things. A warrior. This says angel on it as well. A prehistory. This also uh, talks about a statue, folklore, kind of what I was talking about. Epic times, urban legends. We said that angel and uh, magic. And there's a dragon around here as well. Also, you know, this is like a uh, warrior, an angel warrior energy around. Mm -mm -mm. Lost. People are lost. And they need to find a reason not to be lost anymore. Uh, to fit in and to belong. And there's a lot of memory lane happening. Memory